What is that over there? A little snake or something popping up? Look right here to it. Look right here. Dude, that's a snake over there. That's pretty cool. Yeah. And kind of scary. <laughs> Water moccasin. He's gonna come up in the nut. Get us out of here. What's up guys? We are out in the backwater again. Trying to find a decent spot. Start throwing some lures. Maybe find some uh, some live bait if we can. But uh, it's a beautiful flat day today. Super classy. That's the ocean out that way. This looks like a decent little spot. Look at this little guy. Yeah, right here, I want to float into this. Nice and quiet. A nice little point. I can actually hear the wave over there. Let's see if we can uh, oh, what is that noise? get a little chop water action. That's not going to catch nothing. He's going to try this top water guy real quick. While it's still early. Although it's actually approaching 8 o'clock. So. Yeah. Tide's on its way back out. So the water is moving, which is always good. Oh, right there on the edge. Yeah, that's where I want to get. Right off that grass. Right behind us too. I'd like to be a little bit closer. See if we can get ourselves a little bit closer with the oar. Yes! Oh yeah! Oh heck yeah! Oh yeah! Man, did you hear that? Yes, dude. Top water eat. Oh yes, dude. Oh. Like the third cast. Let's go. Keep that tension on. Yeah. Oh, that was so awesome. That top water eat, bro. Let's see what we got here. Oh, he's staying down. Oh, he's running again. Oh man, what a fight on this little rod. Oh, there he is up top. I think it's a red. Oh, look, yeah, I think it looks it's like a red. It. Oh, that's a good sign. Oh man. <laughs> Dave's hooked into a nice, what looks like a redfish. It's a red, yeah, look at him. Oh man. All right, get ready with the net. I'm going to try to swing him to you. Oh, get look ready. At him. That's oh a good man. One. Get ready. Woo! I'm going to swing him to you. Get ready with the net. Hold on. He's diving down. Swinging around. All right, he's coming up. Get ready. Oh, don't. Woo! He's still got some fight in him. Oh, yeah. All right, here he, he comes. He's coming right to you. You have to work him on that little rod. It's not tight enough. Here. Nope. He's not ready. Got me doubled over, bro. All right, he's gonna come up right here by the boat. He's gone under. He's gone under the boat. He's gone under the boat. There he there is. There he is. Whoa! Oh, get him. Here he comes, right to you. Oh, oh yes, bro. Oh my oh, goodness, crap, dude. dude. We're gonna need Look a bigger boat. Holy crap! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, hold on, let me get him out. Look at this thing. You can hear him drumming. Dave's, I believe, third cast. Third cast in there, bro. I mean, that just looked like such a delicious spot in there. Look at this bad boy. <laughs> That's by far the biggest drum I've ever caught, dude. Woo! Look at that bad boy. 
So to the end, 29 and a half. Look at that, man. On the little Hedon uh, spook. Look at that thing. It's a beautiful guy. Look how right. thick he is, too. Let's get him back in the water. Look at that bad boy. Woo, man. It's a way to start it off. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. I can feel it in his tail, him moving. There he goes. <laughs> Dude, Woo! that was awesome, man. He Woo! was peeling a lot of, and I got the top, the E, bro. He killed it. All right, let's get back over to that spot again. All right, guys, I'm about to swap, uh, retie my lure because from that red, it's kind of frayed up a little bit. So I'm gonna show you guys what I was using too. It's the little heat on one knocker spook, little top water lure, little orange on the head, the bone white, which works really well. A lot of people like that bone white color. Oh, so that's what uh, that red fish ate. We'll see if we can't get hooked up again. Ooh, Matt's gonna shot. switch over to a top water also for the time being. Let it sit for like a second, get the slack out of the line, and that's not like a like this one. And then you just pop the rod down and slowly reel, and it gives you that walk the dog action. Well, it looks like probably a little bait fish. Right there, look, look a shark. Right here, shark. Oh man, look at that guy. He's following my bait. It's a little hammerhead. Can you see him? Bring him this way. He pushed off. He was following the uh, slam shady. I thought he was going to hit it. Man, what was that? Coming right towards us with the bait fish. See him? Oh, what was that? I don't know. Jack almost. It looked like a like a mackerel. That, that kind of the fork tail. Diamondy shape to him too. We haven't had a bite over here. Oh, there's that shark again. No, it's a redfish. It's two reds. Look out! Look out! Look out! They're right there. There's two redfish. Look right there, moving again. Yeah, you see them? I can see their tails. Right in their past. I'm right in the past. Maybe they just don't want to slam shady. Maybe it doesn't look good on here. Maybe you don't have it on nicely enough. things out we just moved over to uh, the mouth of Stono River and we're gonna try to fish this bank over here keeping the wind to our back we hardly saw another little shark over here so at that last spot we got some live bait now still in the cast net we got crab we got shrimp we got fish so uh, we're gonna try a little something different I'm gonna keep throwing some lures we're gonna put one live on and then we're gonna put one cut bait on tide is going out so we are gonna push the boat up a little bit again put the rods that have some live bait on them in the holders it's like a blue crab not sure what that is in the water over there but this is all super shallow still can't tell what that is I think it's a turtle trying to get out of this shallow water 
It's real shallow right here. Go, little buddy, go. Go, 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 go. There it goes. Now it's deep enough. Baby little stingray. I was following the turtle. Look, there's a little tiny stingray right here. Got a little flounder. There we go. <laughs> Not a bad one. Oh. Look at that guy. Not bad. Nice little flounder. I was trying to get it to the boat so that I could measure him and then also get my iPhone out to get a picture. And he was so slippery, I dropped him. Now, as you can see, we're right here by the water. So he's swiveled all the way out. But anyway, got him on a little five inch leprechaun. Just uh, bouncing it off the bottom. I just had another really good hit. And then all of a sudden, it, it hit the rod, bent it, and then all of a sudden I felt the pressure off. And this is what I was left with. It <laughs> bit the whole tail off. I don't know if there's a bunch of flounder down there or what, but we have to re-rig now and try again. Matt's throwing another live one on. A little hammerhead is cruising out there. Alright guys, well, probably gonna be wrapping it up for this one. Got a good red this time. Beautiful big giant one. But uh hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Stay tuned for the next one coming. We'll be back.